Hey everyone, I need your attention for one minute. This is not one of those ads. This is something that has changed my entire life. If you've been listening to this podcast, you know that this is all about personal development as the foundation for everything good in your life. And this podcast is now sponsored by Growth Day, which is the world's first all-in-one personal development app. I mean, oh my gosh, can you imagine having everything all in one place that you need to create? create the life that you want, now you can. So if you've been struggling with your motivation, your mood, your productivity, or your purpose, you have to check this out. Growth Day helps you consciously change your life and achieve your potential. It has all the self-improvement tools, motivational classes, and life coaching all in one place. So many of us want to improve our lives, but the question is how? Where do we start? What do we use? How do you get unstuck? How do you make self-improvement stick? Well, research shows how. It's when you consistently journal, track your habits, set goals, learn from empowering mentors, and challenge yourself that you'll be happier, healthier, and more successful. But let me ask you something. Where do you actually do all of your personal development work? I have to tell you that over 300,000 people use Growth Day for a reason. It works. It's the world's number one software for self-improvement. Growth Day has an amazing mindset journal that I absolutely love, a habit tracker, and a goal-setting system. In fact, I bet if you went to my stories this week, you probably saw me using the journaling app and telling you to do it too, because it's the first time that journaling has ever actually stuck consistently in my life because of this app. And best of all, Growth Day has live inspirational classes every single week from the world's top motivational speakers and life coaches. These are people who have impacted my life in huge ways. These are mentors who I already knew and loved. In fact, this is something that's so huge for me, you guys. I personally teach a class in Growth Day every single month, and it is one of the most fun things that I get to do, and I'd love to see you there. These classes will truly shift your life. There's always something new that you will learn. So join me in 300,000 achievers growing our lives with actual real intention. Visit growthday.com slash Lori for a free trial. Yes, you can try this for free. So go to growthday.com slash Lori and go live your best life. You guys, that's growthday.com forward slash Lori. And I can't wait to see you there. When everyone is investing in themselves at the same level, you know, there's this common denominator of you're all like really in this for real. And you're really there to have this massive expansion that can't happen alone. And that for me was such a game changer that now I know how to put some of those support environments together for myself, but I didn't have those people. Welcome to the Earn Your Happy Podcast. I'm Lori Harder, founder of Light Pink, best-selling author, three-time fitness world champion, and I'm a crazy multi-passionate entrepreneur. My journey has taken me everywhere from being a broke waitress, barista, retails associate, and personal trainer with massive anxiety and no belief in myself to later becoming a multi-millionaire in love with my life. In 2007, my husband and I lost everything. We found ourselves hundreds of thousands of dollars in debt at rock bottom. We had no ideas and I had no education to fall back on. This is when I found personal development and learned everything I could about business, not by choice, but because I realized no one was coming to save me. The conversations on this podcast are going to let you know that you're not alone and that we all feel like we don't know what we're doing. We're going to give you the tools to help you face your fears, take action, start your business and grow those massive dreams that are keeping you up at night. It's time to create a life that you can't hide from and put so much on the line that your higher self is forced to come out. You're going to stop waiting for someone to approve of you and you're going to anoint yourself. Because I'm obsessed about building businesses that give women a platform, I want to feature you. So if you text the word podcast, 
210-496-8363. You can get your questions answered on our Q&A segment along with a shout out. And if you rate, review, and subscribe to this podcast, we're choosing someone every month to get coached and featured on our show. It just might be you. So let's get started. Welcome back to the show. It's time for another quickie because there's always time to fit an inspiration. And I don't, I'm not doing this alone today, which is my theme for the entire year. I am doing this with one of my besties, Lindsay Schwartz of Powerhouse Women, because I'm obsessed and why not do something more fun? That's like my whole thing this year, Lens. Like, why am I doing these things alone? And that's actually the theme of what we're talking about today. We're talking about the number one thing that you can do to scale your business this year. Lindsay, tell me about what those are. Oh my goodness. Well, I feel like we want to share our personal cheat code for what has helped us level up even over the last year. And it's been having this community, this high level networking with people who are doing the things that we want to do, but also doing really expansive things beyond where we even are. And I support myself in that way in so many different ways. Our runs, we run together at least once a week. And that has been everything I know for both of us, because it keeps us in that conversation of, okay, what are you working on right now? How can I help? Who do you need to connect with? And I want to underline for everyone listening, how much, if you want a cheat code, if you want a secret for what we both have done, it's that. And in all different ways. You have been one of my greatest gifts not only this year, but last year and years prior. But definitely now that we're dialing in what we both want and need from the relationship, which I think is also like a really beautiful thing to share is to get your expectations really clear. And also like, what do you want out of this? And I know you and I had talked about, you know, what if we ran twice a week and we really supported each other? And this was a place where we could just like talk about anything and everything. And that has been life changing for me to have a really vulnerable place to be, you know, I mean, you guys, I have literally cried on my runs with Lindsay more times than I think I've ever seen tears in her eyes. So (laughs) definitely I've been that person that has held so much space for me. And that's what we're really talking about today is I think there's a few different places that you not only want to have these soft places to land, but these different groups, these different mentors, these different masterminds, whatever that looks like. So Lynn, tell me some of the things that have really supported you in your business and scaled your business, even outside of just making sure that you're supported even mentally with a girlfriend who's on a similar path. And that's what we do. And I know that that has really helped me scale my business this year in such a huge way. But what are some other ways that you support yourself outside of that? Yeah, I've been thinking a lot about this recently, even thinking back to how you and I really connected. We knew of each other. We were familiar with each other. I think the admiration was mutual, but we never had a chance to really drop in until for me, it was this season where I knew my business was expanding fast. Mm -hmm. And we don't talk enough about how that's confronting sometimes. Realizing that your vision is on a trajectory to grow maybe faster than you're growing personally. And I Mm -hmm. knew I was not about to be the only thing that got in the way of how big this community of women could become. And I invested in a mastermind. And I think what I learned from that experience and I've continued to do is there's something to be said about investing to be in a room that other people are just as bought in financially. When everyone is investing in themselves at the same level, you know there's this common denominator of you're all like really in this for real. And you're really there to have this massive expansion that can't happen alone. And that for me was such a game changer that now I know how to put some of those support environments together for myself. But I didn't have those people. I Mm -hmm. think a lot of times people will see our lives or like the community of women we're with now. What I don't know about what that looked like for you when you guys first started to put yourself in different groups. But for me, I had to pay for it. Mm -hmm. And that's just the honest truth. I didn't have those people right in my immediate circle. I had to find them. And then now I've built other support communities off of that. But what about for you? 
The same thing. I have always paid to get in someone's network or to get in someone's program or get in someone's mastermind. You know, I can think back to the very first thing that I paid a lot of money for was Jack Canfield at the time, Jack Canfield's train the trainer. And that was all people who were doing what I wanted to do. And that container up leveled me faster than anything else. Like after it was actually, so we met three times throughout the year. It was 25 K. We did not have that at the time, but I knew that I needed something that would hold me to it and make me show up because literally Chris was like, if you don't do something with this shit, I'm going to kill you. Like, (laughs) so I was like, that's a lot of pressure and I needed it. I need, like, I have to create my own pressure in everything I do. I created it by getting investors as well with light pink. Like that's a lot of pressure, but that's what I need. Pressure creates, pressure brings out your best self. Like you're going to have to learn how to rise up and become the person who can handle that and get the rituals and tools and all the things. So with that said, it was Jack Canfield paid a lot of money for that. I ended up doing my bliss project event before the third one at the end of the year. So that's how fast that like really worked and up leveled me. And so many people in there were doing events. And I was like, if they can do it, I can do it too. And here's the playbook. Like they're telling me how to do this. So if I would have done that on my own, it would have taken me another three years to figure out maybe five. And because I was in that room with them, it just like accelerated everything. Then the next one was, I invested in Gabby Bernstein as a coach. And then I went to her spirit junkie masterclass, which then helped me pivot even more into personal development and charge more and do a lot of really great things and write books. Like that really helped me because she's an author that sped up my trajectory on writing a book. I may have taken another two to five years to write a book, but because she was already doing it, I invested in this group because I know that's what I was going to learn and get those connections within that room because all those women wanted it as well. So another huge acceleration, you know, and now that I've started, well, Lewis Howe's mastermind was a huge one for us. Like I look around at all of my like incredible friends who are helping me in big ways. Some of my investors, some of the best marketers in the world they were not that before that mastermind. And we did that probably, I think our first one, like six years ago, maybe. Yeah. I think about five, six years ago. And that accelerated everything, Lindsay. So I can trace back everything to a group of people, a mastermind, something that I paid for, invested in, because if I didn't pay a lot of money for those masterminds, you know what I wanted to do? Like even paying that amount of money, I wanted to not show up. Because Mm. it's easy to sabotage yourself and convince yourself that you don't need it. I'm too busy. I think my business needs me more here. No, it doesn't. You need to go in the room and accelerate your business and stop dragging your feet and thinking that you're doing it all alone. And you need to go and get in the room and participate with the people and get the business crack from everyone. Get accelerated. Get your fix. It's freaking amazing. You know, and with Light Pink Lens, I'm creating this for myself too because I want that acceleration. So for you, I know that you also have an incredible mastermind that I've gotten to go and speak at. You've created these containers for women and you've had some incredible superstars coming out of your masterminds doing really big things because you are creating these amazing containers for women. So why do you think, I know why, you're incredible at doing it. But why do you think, what is the magic of what you create? I love that question. And I think it really boils down to this. Women at a certain level of business. So our mastermind is really geared towards someone who is on track to hit their first six figures, but they know there's like way beyond that. They might already be doing six or multiple six and they want to double it, but they want it to feel different. We all know how it feels to hustle, to show up, do the action. But at a certain point, it requires you to think differently about your business. Mm -hmm. It requires you now to empower a team. No one talks about how confronting and how, how much you have to take on to step into that leadership position. But my unique gift is putting together the right group of women, all different industries. I'm actually obsessed with women from different industries coming together because I think we have so much to learn from one another. Mm -hmm. But women always, almost always come in thinking they need more strategy. We don't. Mm -hmm. We need to look at who do we need to become in order to implement the strategy, be the leader that our business demands us to be. But there's a whole other upper limit that we 
blow the roof off of so you can see what's possible. And I know for myself, I couldn't create that kind of transformation for myself. I had to go and put myself in expansive environments that forced me to show up, forced my Mm. higher self to show up. So I'm obsessed with creating those environments for other women because I know, I know what's waiting on the other side, especially when you have the opportunity to work together over the course of a whole year. You Mm. are literally getting not only the access to like, a mentor that you might resonate with, but then the networks, the resources, the connections from every other person in that group. That's literally the secret. That's it. If you want to go really, really fast to realize that you have the opportunity to tap into that collective network and everything that's available if you put yourself in the right room. Amen. I literally have been in your mastermind where I just watch people pop off with ideas, like literally how the energy of the collective works together is all of a sudden someone says something they need and the whole group can go to town on getting that answer for that person. Instead of what would you do at home? If you had that question, maybe you'd get ballsy enough to send a couple emails to some people that you kind of know and kind of don't know. And you probably wouldn't even get that answer back because we all know we suck at getting back to emails because we have 5,000 of them. It takes like two to five days to get that first answer. You forgot what you even asked. Do you see how this works? Like go to the room, go get all the answers you need to then go and integrate. And then by the time you've integrated, you get to go back into the room to get all the answers that you need to go and integrate. It's such an accelerator. I was in, I got a crazy opportunity yesterday to be able to go to a dinner with some really influential people. And the dinner was facilitated just like your mastermind. And it was, we all went around and we all got five minutes to say what we do. And this was most people to me were total strangers in the room. I had heard of them. I tapped on their faces on Instagram and liked their stuff, but five minutes to say who we are and what we need. And we all sat down afterward and we were like, we just accelerated our path by two to five years. We literally just cut out all of the bullshit and accelerated it by years. And that is what you are doing in this group. So I'm so excited because it's one of my favorite things that I get to go do is to speak into your groups and also speak on your stage. I just love, I love your people. I'm like, whenever someone's like, is Lori (laughs) speaking at your event or is she going to coach in your mastermind? I'm like, yeah, just know that anything I do, Lori doesn't have a choice. She's She's going to have to tell me not like, if you ever have something that where you're like, could you just come and support in the audience? And I would love to do that as well, but you're going to have to be clear. Yeah, we're not there yet. That's tough for me. (laughs) Well, it's cool too, because, and I think this is a perfect example. You are someone with this wealth of knowledge. You right now are focusing your efforts on building your next vision. And you still have this burning desire to pour into entrepreneurs. And one of the ways you get to do that is by going to other people's rooms and imparting your knowledge. I mean, if you don't even know what a mastermind is, it's literally that. You come together with a group of like-minded, similar stage entrepreneurs, whether or not they're making the exact same amount of money, they're having the same type of challenges, asking Mm -hmm. the same type of questions, and you get to connect and be mentored by women like us, women who have done things that maybe you aspire to do, or you want to pivot into that industry. It's just like you're saying, it's a multiplier effect. And you know, I'm Mm -hmm. obsessed with that word multiply because I don't believe we have to do it the slow way. I do believe there are are these opportunities in life and in business to get to, you know, really access some high, high level networking, some high level information from people who have done it and are so willing to share their secrets. I can say that you are one of the best teachers and expanders of questioning things because I've been on different runs with you where it's like, are we making this hard or could we make this easier? How could we multiply this with less work? What does this actually look like? So you're so good at getting to the root or the heart of what it actually is and how to multiply it and what you actually need instead of working even harder. And don't get me wrong. I'm not trying to say this isn't going to be hard because it's going to be one of the hardest things that you do if you join a mastermind. It will, if you start a business, right? I literally... I think starting this business has been the biggest personal development I've ever done. And I've walked on fire. So <laughs> literally, yeah, multiple literally. times and multiple times. And it wasn't half as scary as what I'm, what I'm doing right now. So 
I just think you're one of the funniest teachers, one of the most linear as well. And you have a great way of opening people up so that we can actually absorb the information. And truly what, what you are to me and what masterminds are to me is it really is a place where if you have this in your life, you are expanding, extending your tolerance for risk. And we know that if you're a business person, the higher your your risk tolerance and, and ability to sit with uncertainty for long periods of time, the more that you can become successful, <laughs> the more that you can grow, the more that you can scale your business, because that's the name of the game. It's literally expanding your risk tolerance, doing something you've never done before, right? Taking risks on people, taking risks on direction, taking risks on marketing plans, taking risks on creating something out of the blue and believing that it, it will it will make it. So this is absolutely the way that I support myself. It's no secret. I don't want it to be a secret that I'm not doing it alone. I know that, you know, even looking at all of the Sarah Blakely's in the world, they all have their people and they had their places and they have their soft places to land. And it helps meaning their net work, meaning that their group of people is their safety net. And that's what you need because you will just stop yourself, right? Humans, we will sabotage lens like, I have been to places where I've been sabotaging before you show up at the house for the run. And I'm like, bring me back, resuscitate (laughs) me. And I'm I'm, after we run and we talk and I, I can get really vulnerable in that space, which is what your mastermind is. You're resuscitated. And I know that you have calls and different things in between. So who is this for? This is really for someone who knows that they're ready to be challenged at a higher level. There have been these really pivotal points for me. And this is, I'll speak more to like how I've known I was ready. I knew that I was ready to be called into a higher version of myself. Mm -hmm. And yes, there's strategy. Yes, there is epic networking. The entire experience is designed to be expansive in ways you didn't know you needed. You'll literally look back at the end of a year and realize you were a completely different person. I have several women popping into my mind right now that when I look at them, I'm like, holy shit, they like literally look physically different because of the growth they experienced working in a container like this for a year. So depending on when people hear this, we may or may not even have a couple of spots left. This is a year long experience. So it's very immersive. It's so much fun. And we really, we ask different questions is maybe the better way to say it. What does it look like to double your business and have twice as much fun doing it? What does it look like to feel more supported than you ever have and be more in your zone of genius? And then we also are there to unpack the blocks, the breakdowns that show up because you have to confront some really big questions if you're going to allow yourself to operate at that level. And I think the fastest way to do it is in community where you know you're supported. You Mm -hmm. can be that. I love how you use the term launch pad and a crash pad. Mm -hmm. It's a place where you can break down and come up against yourself because you will. It's designed that way. But it's also a place that can launch you into stratosphere you can't even imagine because it's the collective group all using our platforms and our resources to help everyone Mm. grow. And it's honestly like my heart and soul are poured into this program for that reason, because I want more women to experience what you and I have experienced. And they're so worthy. They're so deserving. So obviously, you've got to come back and teach and mentor this year because we have so much fun doing that. And we've got some other epic things planned too. I'm so excited. You guys, this is the number one thing that we are doing for ourselves. This is the number one thing that I'm sharing in every group. I'm going on stages. I'm speaking about it is supporting yourself and creating these different groups for whatever you're doing, especially, you know, making sure that you have people who have gone before you because you want to learn from them. And I know Lindsay facilitates the most magical guests for who you need to hear and learn from. Lindsay, thank you so much for coming on. Thanks for not making me do my quickie alone today. And I I think we're running tomorrow, so I can't wait. (laughs) You know that my favorite thing in the world is when I get to put quickie with Lori in my (laughs) calendar, just so that my team and my husband are like, wait, what? Hey, (laughs) oh, can I share where people can get in touch? Yes. Oh my gosh, yes. Yes. Like I said, depending on when you hear this, we may or may not be closed. But the fastest way to get details and just see if this is a fit is you can text me the word mastermind. We'll put it in the show notes for you too. It's just the number 602-536-7829. Text the word mastermind and you'll get the link and all the details there. Give the number one more time. 
602-536-7829. And we'll link it in the show notes too. Amazing, you guys. So go check that out in the show notes. The time that this is airing, I believe there's only a week until it fills. Is that correct, Lynn? Probably about okay. a week, if not a couple of days. Yeah. Okay. So go check it out now. If you just, I'm, I'm going to just pray that it lands on the perfect person, pulls on their heartstrings, and I get to see them in this group as well, because it is going to be your launch pad and your crash pad. All right, you guys, so grateful for you always. And until next time, earn your happy. Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye. Thanks for listening to the podcast. And I want to make sure that you have my phone number and I'm not kidding. Did you know that I have a community text number for real? My phone number is 310-496-8363. This goes directly to my phone. All you have to do is text the word daily to 310-496-8363. And I literally text you every single day, Monday through Friday, I actually just got done 30 seconds ago texting a bunch of people back and I talk to you all of the time. You guys, people always ask me how I got my community text number and how it works. Well, all you have to do is you can just go to community.com and get your own. Community makes it easy to get a phone number that you can use to build your audience using text. People just text you at your number and they're added to your group. Then you can text them out audios, video links, anything you want. You guys, I text out happy birthday videos. I love to send podcast links, thoughts about life, book recommendations, uh, different events that I'm doing in the local area. Texting gets me out of the noise of social media and directly into your hand. And now you can start texting your people too. Just go to community.com to get your phone number. They give you a 10 digit real phone number, not those weird short codes that look like spam, but it's more than a phone number. Your new number comes with an inbox for SMS and texting. This means you can actually manage your text list from your computer and an app on your phone. You can schedule texts to send at certain times and to certain groups. You can even set up auto replies or let your assistant or customer service team answer your text messages via community's awesome dashboard. Just go to community.com and ask for a free demo. They'll show you how it works and get you your number. It's time to start texting your audience versus just posting on social media. Everyone uses community for that. So go check them out at community.com. I can tell you it's not just great for communicating with my audience, but Chris and I use community and our texts to also sell out our launches. I'm telling you, you get such an incredible response because you really are creating a true deep sense of community. And it's so intimate. It's freaking amazing. Go check it out at community.com. Hey, I know if you're listening to this podcast that you have big dreams and big goals. And one of the things that can really stop you is struggling with your marketing. Trust me, I have been there. Are you using 10 different systems just to build your online business? Then I want you to try Kajabi. Kajabi helps you build your web pages, set up funnels, and sell your courses, content, coaching, or communities. You've been hearing me talk a lot about funnels on this podcast and the importance of your email list. You can get a free trial at kajabi.com. That's K-A-J-A-B-I.com. I've talked about Kajabi before, but here's something that's super cool and new. They just rolled out an AI assistant for creating your online course curriculum. And this means you just type in a topic that you want to create on a course or webinar and bam, it just generates a sample outline for you. It takes a ton of the hard work away. Of course, you're going to customize it to be your own, but this really helps you get over the struggle of how in the world to start 
which is where most people stop. If you're like me, starting is always the hardest part and that's what makes Kajabi so popular. They've made it easier for creators to build web pages, build courses, build coaching programs, build membership sites, build checkout pages, and build email funnels. So if you're struggling with any of those, you gotta go check it out. Go to kajabi.com. Kajabi was really the first all-in-one system and is trusted by over 100,000 creators. I think that's good enough for me. Also as influencers and marketers who use this. And now their smart AI platform makes it easy to take what you know and turn it into an online course and business. Go start building with a free trial at kajabi.com. That's K-A-J-A-B-I.com. Want to know a huge secret to my success? Okay, not only my success, but just about every single person that I have interviewed on this podcast who is successful has this in common. You guys, they love to journal. They capture their life lessons and what they're grateful for. But a lot of people don't keep this up consistently. And most people do know that the research shows that journaling deepens your gratitude and increases self-awareness. But did you also know that journaling decreases stress and helps you achieve your goals faster? In fact, journaling is a huge differentiator between average performers at work and high performing people. It leads to longer term clarity, confidence, and success. So why don't more people journal? Why didn't I journal consistently? Honestly, they don't like staring at a blank page. It's hard to carry a book around with you or a notepad, and they just don't even know what to write about, or they just forget. That's why I know that you're going to love Growth Day. It's the world's number one system for self-improvement, and it's like all-in-one personal development in an app. And it has an awesome digital journal, and people love it. Growth Day's digital journal has hundreds of research-backed writing prompts for self-reflection, positive mindset, confidence building, and success. I use them all the time, and it makes me think in ways that I typically don't, and it makes me ask myself better questions, which we all know gets better results in our life. It even has prompts that help you develop a daily, weekly, or monthly habit of reflecting on your life and identifying areas to grow. So it's a perfect time of year to start journaling, you guys. When you sign up at Growth Day, you also get systems for habit tracking, goal setting, and scoring and improving every area of your life. Best of all, I get to teach there too, you guys. I'm so excited. I hope that I get to see you. I teach live in Growth Day every single month with a new topic just for you. So join me there. Start your free trial at growthdate.com slash Lori.